back with a new LP. Um, I am doing something I have never, never, mind you, never done um, in the process of playing The Sims 3. We are playing a mod-free and CC-free LP. This is a lifetime challenge process. We are playing Ambitions. We are playing Ambitions. The city that came with the Ambitions pack is Twinbrook. It says, in its heyday, Twinbrook was a small industrial town at the mouth of the Sim uh, Simeus Creeks. Years later, the dam was built and it changed everything for the town. Now, with the, an influx of professionals, artists, and inventors living around the Sims Maid Lake, Twinbrooks is experienced a rebirth how will life in this eclectic community turn out? Well, I don't know about the eclects. We're about to start a startup in Twin Brooks. Uh, we are beginning with the firefighter profession. And as this go, we may get through all of the lifetime wishes within this ambition pack. We are playing with ambitions, world adventures, seasons, and generations. This is Twinbrook. This is Rachel Duncan. Um... Wait, and we're going to move her. She's moving here in this lot. Uh, we're purchasing an unfinished lot for $9,000. we are going to get that money back because we're going to demolish the lot and get the money out of it. And I'm assuming that right there is the dam. Um, oh no, the house you've purchased appears to be infested with bugs. Would you like to accept the challenge of catching the bugs? Um, select ignore to return to a normal lot. Let's ignore because I ain't got the time. We ain't got the time. So this is... Uh, the house that comes with this lot but we don't need any of this because we're going to start out our career living at the fire station I wanted to have a motorcycle for transportation And I need her to have a tablet, multi-tab tablet. That's all we need for starting. Okay, so she's starting out with a lifetime wish to be a super, a, a firefighter superhero. She will have to save 30 sim lives on the job in the firefighter profession. That's it. Her leveling up in the career is not uh, is not the importance. Although leveling up means you get to do more fire saving, life saving, but that's her lifetime wish. Um, the selfless act of saving uh, another Sim's life in one of the most is is one of the most exhilarating and rewarding accomplishments your sim can imagine. Only through rigorous training to bulk up your body will your sim have the fortitude and stamina to aid others. The sharp mind, brave heart, and ability to stay calm 
um, under pressure will be beneficial in this in the in unending struggle of sim versus disaster. All right, her her traits, which were randomized, are workaholic, daredevil, vegetarian, um, perfectionist, and heavy sleeper. I don't know how you could be a heavy sleeper and save lives, but we can we getting ready to try that out. We're going to find out. Again, we don't need none of this. That's what we need. We don't need a bush. We don't need a weed. We need some mullions. Um, And I would level the land if it would give me some money, but it don't. It won't. Um... And I can't get rid of the trash can and the mailbox. All right. So now we got seven hundred and seven thousand. We went from six thousand nine hundred to seven thousand. That we all we had in there is a little bit over a thousand bucks. That's crazy. All right. So the first thing I want her to do is let's go and start investing. So we can get this money rolling. All right. Become a partner here at the uh, Burton Boxcar Diner. All right. And then we're going to go join the profession. Move in and start our, start our life. Hold it. We we'll tune up that exhaust. Gracia just tuned the exhaust in the jamboree. Now a lot of those um, story progression messages are gonna pop up, cause remember we're not using mods. I can't turn off all of the pop up notifications, cause we are not using mods. All of the animals run around, the excess food carts and food. I can't turn them off because we're not using mods. Ooh, there's a lot of things in this game that's going to drive me crazy because I can't stop them. I can't turn them off. I can't adjust them. All right, congratulations, Rachel now is partner in the Burton Box Card Diner. She is now entitled to the share of profits, which she can pick up weekly. Weekly. So every Monday, we'll get paid for being a partner in the box car. And now we'll go here to the fighter fighter. Uh, to the fire station, fire de uh, visit the fire department. We're going to join the fire profession. All right, firefighter career. She'll start as a water girl, weekly stipend. We're getting paid once a week. Weekly stipend is 276 bucks. 276 bucks to give them five days of our work. Our, our, that's cheap as hell. Um, That ain't enough money. Five days? Come on, y'all. Looking for a job in the challenging, interesting, and well Rick, looking for a job that is challenging, interesting, and well respected. If putting out fires, rescuing Sims, and aiding the neighborhood during times of emergency stirs a passion deep inside of you, then start saving lives 
by start starting down the heroic career path of a firefighter today. Yes, we will accept this career. All right. So we go here. She's a water girl. Salary is 276 a week. City Hall pays firefighters a weekly salary for the work done as a firefighter. She's working Monday through Fridays from 9 to 5. Working 9 to 5. What a way to make a living. Um, she's off Saturdays and Sundays. And right now we're on a Sunday. She starts in one day. We have to respond to emergencies, build up our skills, which they're looking for us to build up athletic and handiness skills, and um, befriend fellow firefighters in order to gain job experiences. So once this fills up with job experience, we're act actually promoted. That's the reason why Leveling up in this career is not the biggest of importance. It is the process of saving lives that really makes the difference in this lifetime wish and even in the career. Um, congratulations, Rachel just got a new job. Rachel needs to be at the fire station at 9 a.m. Monday. Noble intentions and heroic stride will only get you so far. Grit, courage, and the know-how around the fire station and amidst a five-alarm blaze are the only thing that will earn you a promotion. Watch the, for, watch the alarm and be ready to respond to emergencies. Rachelle Duncan has received a new uniform and has a new career related topic to discuss with other Sims. Rachel now makes 276 simoleons per week and works from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So there we go. All right. So the, right now, the 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 uh, skills that really gonna get her career going is athletic and handiness, and we can do those with um we can do those right now and start earning the job experience before we start the job. So there's a few things I need to do on this lot in order to for me to start playing. Remembering I'm not playing with mods because we're going to first put in in ooh, ooh, um, testing cheats enabled true. Ooh, testing cheats, I typed something wrong. We're going to add in by debug. And the first thing we're going to do is go in here and remove all of the parking lots. Um, well, first, yeah. Well, first thing we're going to do, we're going to come down here and move a few things around. This is the exercise. We don't have to go to a gym. We have our own gym here at the station. Um, I want to add in a exercise bar, which is $200. I'm going to get my $200 back. Okay. And over here in this bathroom... We don't have a sink. So we're going to add a sink. 
in the bathroom. That's 120 bucks. So that's a total of $320 that I need to get back from the fire station. Need to add that $320 back. Well, part of it is here. We're going to sell these parking spaces. This is 150. And we're selling the parking spaces so whenever she goes out, I don't want her bike to be here by default. And uh, then somebody else may take her bike and use it as community property. That's not what's going on here. Uh, so that's 150. This is another 150. So that's $300. Remembering that we need to get $320 back. All right. So we're going to put her bike in her inventory and sell this last um, property, this last um, parking space. So that's another $150. Take 20 out of the 150. We owe them 130 bucks. We owe the company 130 bucks. So, um, or we owe the game 130 bucks. So, we have 1,477, which means our household funds, house. Hold fun one word funds for Miss Duncan is one thousand three hundred and forty seven simoleons. And if my math is wrong, y'all household not funds, household fund. Is 1,347 simoleons. What am I missing? Am I spelling something wrong? Oh, not household funds. Sorry. It's family funds. Space Duncan, last name of the household, is 1,347. Enter. And that's what we start in the game with, 1,347. Let's take a tour of the fire station. This fire station is added to the game through Ambitions Pack. If you add Ambitions Pack to your Sims 3, this is a fire station that you will find under the community lots in your edit town. You can use this fire station in any world in your game. Okay, so we're starting out with a three floor fire station. On the top floor, we have a telescope for just checking out the stars. You ain't got nothing else to do. You want to check the stars, see what's happening. Um, that Go up there and, and get it done. We got three bedrooms in this bedroom. Three beds in this bedroom. With a full bath, showers, tub, I mean, showers, toilet, and sink. We also got an alarm bell. We can do our, our alarm repairs here on this floor. We also got a door that leads from the outside of the fire department um, to as a fire uh, escape for the outside area with, with the sliding pole. We have the um, recreation uh, for your athletic skills. You can come back here on this trampoline. You can throw the ball around football or baseball. Cooking area, congregating area where we can sit out and chill. This is on our downtime. So there's a lot of things that could be done here on this lot um, to start off your life as a firefighter. Uh, here we have five beds in this uh, room, including a little mirror here. There's a fire alarm, a couple of, uh, of uh, firefighter jackets are hanging on the wall next to the beds. 
Uh, we have our firefighter pole. We can slide down to the next floor. This is our third floor. Here's a second full bathroom, two showers, one toilet and a sink. Same as this one here, two showers. One, so we got two full baths on the third floor. We come down to the second floor. We have um, four toilets, two sinks, a recreation area um, where we can sit down and relax and watch TV. We got books we can read. We have a bar here so we can entertain ourselves. We got uh, the, the game over here. Can't remember what the name of this game is. Foosball. We got a foosball table. We got a foosball table. We have a um, chess table. We have painting. We got a computer. We can chill at the computer. We can even learn how to play music. All right. And even got a video game system. So we can see here if we don't want to watch TV, we can play video games. All right. We got another pole. That'll slide down. And we have this balcony area that shows us on the first floor, we're all business. Okay. We have a bell here. We can, we can, we can repair the alarm from the outside of the station. There's one there. There's another here. And there is even another here. Okay. There's the outside pole. Here's our inside pole. We got our fire truck. We have another uh, library book, uh, a book stand, bookcase. We have a, a working table where we can uh, build up on our handiness skills. Remember, handiness and athletic are the skills that progress us through this career. We have another computer with another um, alarm bell. We have another half bath with four toilets and two um, two uh, sinks. And then we have our eating area with our table and chairs, a refrigerator, sink, cabinets, a garbage disposal. So I don't know why we got another... Um, why we have a trash can and a garbage disposal, which don't make a whole lot of sense to me. Um, we have a stove on the property that will not work for us. Uh, I don't know why the stove is here. We have a stove here, but I do want to add one more thing to this um, and we'll get our money back for it. As you can see, um, this says we can get stoves, but the stoves we get are not your conventional stove like this. We have a baking set that we can use to bake pies and things like that. We have a canning set that we can use. We have the uh, Japanese um, hibachi set that we can use. This is a cauldron, which we're not getting into. That ain't nothing we going to do. We have this stove here that will work excellent for us. Um, how much is this stove? This stove is 1,250 simoleons. Um, we're going to add this. And we're going to remove this. 1,300 and 50 simoleons so technically they owe us a hundred simoleons and we're going to remove this garbage can that's another 50 so that's 150 simoleons that um that we owe them rather rather we owe them a hundred we owe the um the the company a hundred and 50 simoleons we're gonna add this and i'm missing something 
I didn't see the pizza oven. I'm missing a pack. I'm missing a world. Um, I don't have Monte Vista in my game. I will add it. And once I add it, I will add the pizza oven to this game. Um, I'll set it right there. So those would be two areas that they could cook from. Um, and I owe, oh, wait a minute. I owe the game... No, they owe me a hundred dollars because I gave, I t took away and gave them. No, I owe them a hundred plus the fifty for the trash can, so I owe the game a hundred and fifty dollars. Um, no, I don't. I owe them one hundred dollars. Um, family. Funds, Duncan. No, I owe him fifty dollars. One hundred. No, one fifty. One thousand three hundred and forty-seven is what I should have. All right, so we back to our starting money. So let's start our gameplay. Those are the only adjustments that I would add to this lot that we'll be living on while we play the game. Uh, we're using our tablet to start listening to the handiness skills because at this moment, we can't do any repairs to any of the fire alarms or the truck because we don't have Handiness skill. Handiness skill is needed to upgrade the fire engine. So, it is Sunday morning, 9.25 a.m. We're going to begin our game. Uh, and we're going to start working out on the, on the ballet bar to gain our athletic skill. Athletic and handiness. So we're going to work on both of them. All right. So um, some of the things she want to do, she want to put out a fire. She want to put out one fire. Uh, and we'll get 225 happiness, uh, lifetime happiness points. She wants to learn the athletic skill, which we're working on that right now for 750 athletic, I mean, 750 lifetime happiness points. Take an athletic class that we are not going to do for 700. It costs 450 points for this athletic at 450 simoleons. We're not, we're not going to do that, but we're going to earn our athletics by, um, Trial and area, y'all. Era, y'all see her skills right now. Look a little busted. Let's see if we could turn on a little bit of music to help. Right now, you can see her mood uh, meter is very happy, but it's not full. Um, she is having a blast. Gives her forty more mood points. Um. She is fulfilled for 15 more points, and she has uh, uh, no uh, mood effect, but she's happy that she's learning handiness. All right, so it's, she stopped learning handiness. We're going to come back here and listen. When, we, when we're learning skills, you'll see the thing on the side when we're not learning It'll let you know. Um, so right now we've level one on handiness, but we still haven't learned our athletic. We're going to go back to that. Um, so I'm asking her to stop the athletic, start the tablet up again, and we're going to get the exercise going again. 
see here we're listening to a tab cast for handiness we're listening to a tab cast aka podcast that's uh what is this tool talk pop podcast that's what we're listening to um so we're gonna turn on music the default music right now is giving her 30 mood experiences because we are listening to should be um her favorite is um classical music let's see what we're listening to yep we're listening to classical music so it's adding to her happiness by doing the things she like her classical music and eating fruit parfaits those add to her happiness look at her go she just earned a athletic skill all right we about to level up level two on the handiness our athletic is moving right along seven more minutes on handy six four three two one we're gonna stop the athletics start the handiness back up again and we're gonna get her to go back and exercise some more we're gonna get our exercise up good enough so when we get on a treadmill we don't have to worry about her falling off the treadmill or having a rough time on lifting weights either so that's the reason why i put in the ballet bar now she wants to go for a jog she's level two in athletics now and level two handiness almost halfway through her handiness skill up oh, we're, we're we're a bit funky she wants to buy a shower i'm not buying no shower we got more than enough showers here she wants to buy a washing machine that's not gonna happen um and we can remove this athletic class um it would only give her two uh points which we've already earned without spending money all right so once this ends we're gonna end her and what this get okay we we're tired we're tuckered out she's getting ready to end her fitness because we are pooped okay let's we gonna go take that shower get the funkiness off of her so that's this has no effect on her mood which is good because right now we're very happy but what we have done on behalf of our employment we're almost ready to level up to level two in the firefighter profession and we haven't even started the job yet. So no matter what we do, as long as we're earning our handiness and athletic skills, we will be making improvements on our career. So since she's fatigued now, what I want her to do is come over here and do some maintenance on the fire alarm. And then we'll go upstairs and do maintenance on the the um the fire truck Rachel is handled in business she is having a blast all right so now the fire alarm doesn't need repair it's up to to, to, to snuff now I need her to come over here and do some maintenance on the fire the truck all right and we have to remember that she is a vegan vegetarian rather so gotta keep abreast of what she's eating 
every now and then I like to play that trait vegetarian. All right, we're 97. Look like she's already completed. Okay, she's done with the maintenance. With that, she's leveled up to level three in handiness. We're level two in athletics. She wants to go for a jog, but we can't do that. We got seven hours of fatigue. What she can do is start listening to athletics. Listen to the athletic. Is it in here? No, it's not. So we, if I was modded, we could listen to the athletic skill. We can't listen to the athletic skill. We can listen to handiness and do handy. We can listen to cooking because that would be nice. Listen to cooking. Let's see what her needs are. Let's listen to cooking. And then we can go through the fire station.